Hello, my name is Jason Barikmoa and you are welcome to today's class on Agricultural Science. Our theme for today is Produce Packaging and Marketing and our topic Farm Records and Bookkeeping Part 1. In this lesson, we will learn about farm records, their importance to farmers as well as computer-aided farm records. So by the end of the lesson for today, you should be able to define farm records, state the importance of farm records in agriculture, list and explain the various types of farm records, and lastly, describe computer-aided farm records and benefits. As a student, I know you do keep record of your personal belongings, such as books, pencils, pens, shoes, and your clothes at home. Other people too also practice the act of record keeping. They do this for those things that are important to them. People all over the world keep track of their daily activities such as going to the gym, going for shopping, and so on. They also give account of those things that matter to them. Things like their handset, house furniture, their cars, and landed properties. Well, individuals are not the only ones that practice this act of record keeping. Business owners and organizations also do this. They do this because they want to keep track of their properties like the furniture they have in their office, their premises, and other things they have within their premises. They also do this to keep track of their activities such as training and other things. They do this in order to monitor the progress of their establishment or their company. You may wonder, what about farmers? Farmers also practice the act of record keeping in order to monitor the activities as well as progress in their farm. So now, let us look at what farm record really is. Farm records are documents used to keep account of different activities happening in a farm. These activities may be works, events, materials, expenses, incomes, and other activities happening on a farm. You may wonder, what is the importance of farm records to farmers? Farm record is very important to farmers because it helps them to manage their farms. It helps them to give account of all activities and items they have on their farm. For example, a farmer may want to keep account or keep record of the number of crops he or she have harvested in his farm, his livestock, his staffs, and tools. This record will help the farmer to manage his farm effectively. So now, let's look at some of the importance of farm records to the farmer. Number one, they help the farmer to keep stock and manage every aspect of his farm. With farm record, the farmer is able to list all items that he has on his farm as well as manage these things effectively. Number two, it gives the farmer adequate information that he or she needs in order to plan operation on his farm as well as to know the amount of money he needs to run his farm. Number three, it helps the farmer to ascertain the progress made in every aspect of the farm and the overall performance of the farm. This is what we mean. A farmer takes record of the activity that is happening on his farm. He sits down, goes through those records, and notice some of the areas in which progress are made on his farm and know which area is performing well. Number four, they help the farmer to calculate his losses and seek ways to mitigate them. What do we mean by this? When a farmer engages in an activity on his farm, either to sell his produce or to buy produce, he evaluates the amount he has spent. That is, if there are shortfalls, he looks for ways in order to minimize or reduce these shortcomings. Number five, they enable the farmer to make informed decisions required for the good of the farm. This is what we mean. A farmer will bring all his records and monitor them, study them, and look at areas in which he needs to make improvement. Whatever decision he makes to improve the performance in his farm is actually an informed decision based on the record he has been keeping all this while. Number six, they help the farmer monitor changes in the prices of products bought or sold. 
For example, let's say a farmer bought an egg two weeks ago for 30 naira. And now they are selling that same egg for 50 naira. He will go to his record, look at these changes in his prices and make decision. Number seven, let's say I am a farmer now and I want to get money or borrow money from a bank, an establishment, government agency or other organization like the World Bank. For me to access these loans, I will need to produce record of my farm to prove that actually I am managing my farm very well. Lastly, they aid the farmer in the calculation of the annual tax of the farm. With accurate record, the farmer can actually calculate the amount of money he or she is supposed to pay as his annual tax to the government. Now, let us look at different types of farm records. Farm diary. This type of record is used to keep account of daily activity happening on a farm. Some of the things that a farmer will want to record in a farm diary include date of planting his crops, date of germination, as well as flowering. He can also put in his farm record the amount of fertilizer, pesticide, and herbicide that he applied on his farm, as well as the date of application. Farm inventory. This is a record that contains the details of all assets on a farm. Some of those assets include tools, machinery, lands, as well as their monetary values. This record will help the farmer to calculate the value of all his assets and determine the net worth of his assets. Impute record. This is a record that contains all items as well as money spent running the farm over a period of time. In impute record, things like cost of seed, cost of livestock, cost of equipment, cost of labor, ETC, are documented in it. This impute record actually gives the farmer an idea of the amount of money incurred over a period of time. With this record, the farmer is able to calculate his or her profit or loss. Production record. This is a record of all items produced in the farm. It could be crops, livestock, livestock feed, etc. This record also contains the quantity of produce harvested in that farm. It may also contain the weight of livestock. This record also enables the farmer to know which aspect of his farm is making progress or which aspect of his farm is more profitable. Labor record. When you hear the word labor, what comes into your mind? It is simply physical work that is done. So, labor record is used to document or record those labor activities that takes place on a farm. The labor record is used to record the number of staff a farmer has on his farm, as well as the work that was done on the farm and the amount of money the farmer used in achieving or doing that work. This labor record can also be called labor diary. Sales record. This is the record of all sales, be it chicken, be it goats, be it crops that were sold from that farm. It gives the details of all items sold from the farm and their prices. Consumption record. Now, this record contains all farm produce or products that were consumed by the farmer and his family. Now, let us take an exercise that will help us to see if we understand which item is best placed in or under which farm records. So now, this is the activity. The following data shows the expenses incurred in Mr. Okoro's farm for the month of August 2019. So what are you going to do? Enter the data in the corresponding column of the farm record as it is showing on your screen. I believe that you'll be able to do it. When you're finished, you can show what you've done to your teacher or an older member of your family. 
Now, let's talk about computer-aided farm records. Now, what is computer-aided farm record? Simply put, there are those records that are kept using a computer. For a farmer to be able to keep record on his computer, he needs some software that will help him or her to do this. This software comes in different forms. Some are designed to help the farmer to prepare payroll, keep track of animal health, make invoices, and keep track of sales and other day-to-day -day activities. On our screen, we can see some logos that show examples of these softwares. On the screen, we have a logo of Microsoft Excel, Microsoft Access, as well as the body of another app called Crop Tracker. But there are other examples of applications that are used by the farmer to keep records of activities on his farm. They are Quicken, QuickBook, and ThinkPack. There are other ones, but these are the ones that we mentioned in this lesson. So now, let us talk about some of these applications. We are starting with Microsoft Excel. This is a spreadsheet application that a farmer uses to impute numerical data of his farming activity as well as carry out some simple and complex calculations. Microsoft Access. Microsoft Access is a database management application that a farmer can use to keep track of all records in the farm. Then we have the QuickBook. This application offers the farmer the opportunity to record all transactions online for easy access. With the information that the farmer entered, he or she can confidently and conveniently prepare his staff payroll, track profits, and prepare inventory as well as invoices, etc. C-Shelf. This is a management system that helps the farmer to manage his or her inventory. It helps the farmer or other organization to keep record of all the inventory in that organization. Quicken. This is a financial application that helps the farmer to keep track of all financial transactions that takes place on his or her farm. Finpack. This is a financial management system that helps a farmer to manage the finances of his or her farm. Now, let us look at some of the benefits of computer-aided farm records to a farmer or other organization. Number one, it is very easy to get information from the computer, which is not possible when using books to make records in an organization or on a farm. Two, it is easier to arrange and sort your record with a computer and arrange them into different groups. Number three, it is easier to reconcile your farm records with other documents like bank statements, receipts, etc. Number four, it is easier to monitor farm financial progress, example, income, increase in sales, etc. using the computer. Number five, farm records that are stored on the internet by the farmer can be easily accessed irrespective of the location of the farmer through the internet. So these are some of the benefits of computer-aided farm records. We have come to the end of the lesson for today, but before we go, let us summarize what we have discussed so far. We have discussed that farm records are documents that are used to keep account of different items and activities in the farm. We've also discussed that farm record helps farmers manage their farms, calculate losses and annual tax, ascertain progress and performance, make proper decisions and monitor changes in product prices and access loans. We've also said that the different types of farm records are farm diary, farm inventory, production record, input record, labor diary, sales record and consumption records. Moving on, we talked about computer-aided farm records, which are records that are kept using the computer. And lastly, we've also discussed some benefits of computer-aided farm records. 
we've seen that record kept on the computer are easy to get, arrange, and sort. We've also discussed that they are easy to reconcile with other farm records. We've also discussed that computer-aided farm records can be used to monitor financial progress in a farm and they can be accessed anywhere through the internet. Now, let us test ourselves using some questions to know how far we understood this lesson. Question number one, a farm record helps the farmer to do the following except A, it helps the farmer to keep stock and manage every aspect of the farm properly. B, it helps a farmer to employ staff. C. It helps a farmer to ascertain the progress made in every aspect of the farm. Or D. It helps a farmer to calculate his loss and profits. The answer is B. It helps a farmer to employ staff. Question 2. One of the benefits of computer-aided farm record is A. It is very easy to delete stored data. B. It can be operated anywhere irrespective of location through internet connections. C. It is not affected by computer virus. Or D. It helps a farmer to calculate his loss and profit. The correct answer is B. It can be operated anywhere irrespective of location through internet connection. I hope you can now define farm record and describe computer-aided farm records and benefits. See you in my next class. Bye for now. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, drop a comment, and subscribe to our channel. You can also turn on notifications to stay updated on new videos on this channel. This Brain Friend video was brought to you by Synforest. For more of these amazing e-learning videos, get your copy of Brain Friend. With more than a thousand e-learning videos, over 74,000 test items in more than 40 subjects, a career counseling guide, and many other amazing features, BrainFriend remains your foremost e-learning and exam preparatory software. BrainFriend. Learn better. Make excellent grades.